now to give you a perspective of the video playback clarity and the kind of loudspeaker output you can expect from this phone we are playing a high definition video first of all we will talk about the wing angles so as it is a super amoled display which is a curved display on the edge as you can see it is not going to be completely full screen but there is a slight amount of black bar over there which is there when it comes to playing the video uh, however the video is playing in full screen and there is no issue with the playback you can see the video from almost any angle uh, on this display so wing angles are very good and i would say better than some other devices out there so wing angles are good in terms of loudness let me just increase the volume to full so loudspeaker is over there on this part on the edge which is pretty loud and it is again it is again one of the loudest loudspeaker i have seen on a device like this and you can hold the device like this you can also place it like this on a table so if you place it like this on a table the sound will not get muffled unless you cover it like this which is good and the device does get uh, so the device does get slightly warm over there especially at this side when you play a video or uh, when you try to play a high definition game on this device hardware is concerned let me just show you the system information so here we have the system information the model number is sm g925 i we have 64 bit processor on this device which is clocked at 1.5 gigahertz so there are two quad core processor on this device one is clocked at 1.5 gigahertz the other one is clocked at 1.2 gigahertz and when it comes to the display resolution we have 1440 into 2560 display resolution which is pretty high in terms of the pixel density around 577 pixels per inch which is pretty good and you will not notice any pixelation on, on this device when it comes to the gpu we have mali t760 m8 gpu which is also a pretty powerful gpu to handle games and here we have the list of sensors which are pretty good in terms of the number of sensors which you can expect on a device like this we have accelerometer sensor gyroscope sensor magnetic field sensor barometer sensor rgb step detector step counter significant motion and then a lot of other sensors which can actually do a lot on this phone as far as applications are concerned and when it comes to the display revolution as i already told you the display is very good colorful and it is very nice as far as the resolution is concerned and you will not notice any pixelation on this device and even if you take a closer look you will not notice any pixelation on this on end 2 we have got a pretty good score of 67534 as you can see over there and this device is actually at the top as compared to any other device out there in the market but one thing which you can easily experience and this is something which has happened with this one that while running the N2 benchmark utility for approximately two minutes the device has heated up and i can experience the device getting hot at the back side also on the edges so both the back side and the edges are kind of hot as of now and the front edge is also slightly hot over there but over here we have less amount of uh, temperature uh, being uh, risen on Inamark we have got a score of 59.4 fps and this indicates that you can actually play any high definition game on this device without any issues and we are coming up with a gaming review as well very soon 